sending valuable coins to stacks and bowers to consign them for auction. This is how I do it. This is what you want to do. First, you go over to Stax Bauer's website and you can look up uh, why consign with us and different details about what they do and how they do things. If you want to sell or consign, then you can come up here and schedule an appointment. If you're around the New York area and you want to drive there, uh, they have a Philadelphia store, a Hong Kong office, and they have a New York store and how to sell at auction. I mean, it pretty much lays it out. Welcome to Stax Bowers videos. Now, one thing I would do and what I personally do is I call them on the phone. I, I have someone who I deal with there and I will tell them I'm going to send some things. And what they do is they send you a consignment form. And this is what the consignment form looks like. Okay. And here's all the numbers and the faxes. You can fax the form, but you want to send it with the coins. Okay. So, you fill out all your pertinent information here, the date, the denomination, the grade, and some notes that you might put on there, and then the value, which you can go to, you're, you're sending graded coins. Very rarely will they handle any raw coins, and you want to talk to them about it. And here's a certification number. So since you're sending graded coins, it's easy to go to a price guide and see how much they're worth. So you would do that. Once you fill all this out, they're going to send you a DocuSign, an agreement that you agree for the consignment and you can choose if you want a, a, a reserve on this stuff. You can choose not to have a reserve. I don't put reserves online. So what I'm going to do is I'm sending off, as we talked about, um, these notes here just to see where they go. They're PCGS, they're top pops or PCGS. Don't know how much that's going to mean right now because PCGS just started grading again. But right now that's what these are. Then I've got some of these uh, gold coins that I'm going to send off. Um, actually, this here is a 1806. It's the half dollar that I've had up on the site that no one's interested in. So I want to see if someone's interested at auction, see what happens and let it go. And then here's the gold coins I was talking about. Here's one of them. I'm going to send them off for auction. We'll just see where they go. Hopefully I do pretty good with them. But that's basically what you do for Stacks and Bowers. You give them a call, they'll walk you through it. I mean, they're a really nice company to deal with. You know, I, I could deal with a lot of different auction companies. I could do it myself, but I would rather use Stacks and Bowers. Uh, that's at Stacks Bowers. I know it doesn't have an and there, but it's Stacks Bowers. Uh, really nice people. And, and I've had videos that you should check out that I've where I had a huge and very rare. Uh, some of the coins were. It was the the Paramount, this Redfield hoard that was graded by Paramount, and then I sent them off to NGC and had them graded. And you can watch that. I mean, it shows here Stacks and Bowers and what happened with the auction. And I actually show everybody, you know, the motions. Actually, the process I went through to handle these because some of these Redfields were so toned and beautiful that it was amazing. I really didn't want to, you know, sell all of them, but it was something else. It really was something to behold. Take a look here. I just received but, um, Max and Bauer. Take a look at the auctions and some of the coins here. I mean, they were just, just something else. So anyways, as far as shipping is concerned, I use a flat rate box. Um, I use USPS, registered mail, put the appropriate insurance on it. You can use FedEx. You can use uh, UPS, whatever it is that they accept. I mean, you can look on their site and see the best. I always use this. I just put it in this. I pack it really well. It can't sound like coins, feel like coins, and there can't be anything about coins on the outside of it. Sometimes the USPS will scare you a little bit. They'll go other places, but, you know, I've not had a lost package. So that's how I do it. If you're interested in sending coins to Stacks and Bowers, that's how you do it. Go over to the website, give them a call on the phone. And you can take your chances. A lot of times the reason I send coins or auction, I don't know for sure what they're going to sell for. And maybe I've tried to sell them and just didn't get a lot of interest. So it's an easy way to get them out in front of more people and at an auction house. And also they'll let me use Coin Help You to help market my channel. Call them the Coin Help You Gold Collection basically is what it'll be or Coin Help You Collection. And they'll mention it. And all around it helps everybody. It helps Stax Bowers. They get a lot of people seeing these videos and advertisement for them. And I get to sell my coins for a good price. 
So thanks for watching my latest video. Please like, share, and comment, and have a great day.